Hey, it's Random Pop Culture News Freak here, a.k.a. Mainly where we're reading guys in wrestling shorts and not so short as channel. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram. Um, make sure you all my links just in case anything bad happens to the channel. We'll get the leader shadow ban, all that bad stuff, or the good stuff. You want to follow me on Twitter, of course. Anyways, um, I know this came out about a day ago, but still, I got to give my two cents on this. I've talked about Horizon Zero Dawn and, of course, Horizon Zero Dawn once, almost massive amounts of times on this channel. But uh, these are the freaking actual rumors. This one, WCC um, F Tech. I'll leave the um, link description box down below if any guys want to read it on your own personal time, of course. So there's that. So it says Horizon, New Horizon Zero Dawn. PlayStation 5 Remake is in the works alongside the multiplayer game. Remember, this comes from Francesco DeMeo from um, WCC F Tech. Referenced these fools a few times before. So yeah, let's begin. So this is Horizon Zero Dawn Remake. Is currently in the works for the PlayStation 5 alongside multiplayer game based on the series according to the rumors circulating online. And I got some real big news here. CEO for Jim Ryan or whatever. I might do this in a separate video. I don't feel like talking about it already. He's he's making some freaking deals over there. Phil Spencer. I guess for Xbox Activision. There it goes right there. <laughs> Clue to Brussels voice over control you Xbox Activision deal. So I'll read that one in another separate video. As this is reported, let's get on to the main news here. Reported by MP1 First in cooperation for VGC, a remake for the open <clears throat> open world developed by Guerrilla Games is in development for the current generation console by Sony. Whether it is or is not yet known, if this will be more of a remaster than a remake built from some of the ground ups, the new version of the game will be featured improving lighting system overhauled textures, improved animations, and a new character model additionally the new version of the game will feature many of the accessibilities options introduced in horizon forbidden west much display modes and qualifications the quality of life is going to be improvements there's another one about horizon zero dawn tweet oh okay i didn't know about that one okay sounds fairly interesting let's continue on outside of that we are told that the biggest focus on the accessibility options of the sequel are introduced different graphic modes will be available throughout Though that is a given since the most PS5 games have a performance quality and uncapped performance to take advantage of VRR, variable refresh rates. First time I've ever heard that freaking statement before a concept. So uh, it also goes on to say, <clears throat> and, uh, for gameplay changes themselves, there are some subtle improvements, mostly those being quality of life improvements, sequel brought. It wasn't confirmed whether or not this wasn't confirmed, yeah. Yeah, whether or not we see flyable mounts of a glider, though we're supposed to be. Supposedly, that is unlikely a given. <clears throat> unlikely a given to their story related to the importance of the sequels. Horizon Zero Dawn PlayStation, or aka PS5, PlayStation 5 Remake, isn't the only thing. Entry into the series in the works as a PS5 PS PC multiplayer game is currently in development. Mon not much else is been revealed about this project other than than other than that they will feature the tribes introduced so far into the series as it turns into the zero dawn remake remaster it's isn't the only horizon related project in the works as we learn from the sources info collaborated with our original source that's what they get these guys said from wccf tech let's move on that a team Presumed by Gorilla, to be Guerrilla Games and PlayStation currently de developing Horizon Online multiplayer for both PS5 and PC. All right. Good ass fucking turn. So let's move on. Two sources have verified that the project is indeed real with the third generation, or excuse me, third giving some brief details that it will be featured from a co-op customization set around the differences between tribes established between the Horizon. No, oh, man. I am not want to like skip all that shit. Oh no, it's right here. However, we've not been able to get the course of the da, da, da. details, right? Same old shit there. And I'll read a little bit of this time about it. Guys, read the rest of the room. While Rising Zero Dawn has not been released five years ago, the game obviously holds up well. But it seems that Sony it seems like this isn't stopping Sony from having a remake already. Yeah, so overall thoughts, views, and opinions on this? I feel like it's way too freaking early for this shit. Maybe give it about seven, ten years max. Uh, so that's about, let's see, 2026, 2028, way, way later in this decade. Um, then they should have freaking did the freaking um, remake or master for this thing. Because five years, man. It wasn't even that long. I thought it was six years a little bit, but five? Come on, man. 
Are you kidding me? Like, Sony, bro. What kind of crack are they smoking the fuck over there? Like, what are they smoking over there? Like, seriously, man. What's going on in their heads? I do not freaking know. Uh, nowadays, they do a lot more censorship for a lot of Sentai and very fan servicey games for JRPGs and shit like that, which is really fucking sad, man, honestly. At least Microsoft, Xbox ain't doing that. And uh, Nintendo's kind of doing it a tiny bit, which kind of sucks. I don't know why the hell they're doing that, because they're going back to their old roots. I don't want them to do that shit. I really, really don't want them to do that, but it is what it is anyway. Yeah, last but not least, they already just finished doing the VR one, like, a couple months ago. So, I don't know why they decided to, like, do a remake or remaster out of any of this, man. It wasn't even that long ago. And, um, two other things completely unrelated. I know the Google Stadia freaking died. It's been dead for a long-ass fucking time, so I'm not surprised. Thank God. That thing was already freaking, um... I was already a dying freaking thing. I heard rumors that Hideo Kojima had something to... He was gonna actually put a few games on his projects on the stadium. But, of course, that thing's probably been a dead thing. It's gonna die in January 18th. It's crazy, because it's only a few days before my birthday. I'm 29. Next year. Also, um... Completely unrelated. I just heard that, like, I think Disney's gonna try to buy the Bleach anime. I don't know. That's gotta be a big master rumor. That's all, guys. Here for another video. Links description box down below. Cartoons are inside for the playlist. The music playlist. I was playing. That's it. Peace out, ladies and gentlemen, bros and families and fingers as always. Talkers and Nikki Kamotas. I will see you when I see you. you guys, have a good day. Have a good night. Wherever you're universe out there, see some future content. Share with the video game ministry news and manga news, Twitch news, drama news. Um, three or four times out of the month, reaction review segments, and that's it. Take it easy. Peace out, my star card. Ladies and goodbye. See you on the flip side. They'll take the JABS, the poison, um, aka the hydrogels, and all the other freaking uh, nanobot shit. And that's it. Take it easy. I'm not. Deuces. See you soon.